This is a Little People Big World update for July 2023. This month, Tori felt overwhelmed, Amy and Zach went to the Little People conference, Jeremy and Audrey left Oregon, and big news for pumpkin season at Rolla Farms. So, is pumpkin season cancelled forever with all the property and family drama? Amy had previously said that she thought last year would be the last pumpkin season ever, but... The Roloff Farms Instagram account just confirmed that pumpkin season will be back in the fall. It said, yes, pumpkin season is happening this year. We've got a few questions about this, so wanted to confirm. Mark your calendars. It's on. And I hear the Instagram account is managed by Isabel, Jacob's wife. Meanwhile, Amy, Chris, Zach, and Tori and their kids attended the Little People Conference in Austin, Texas this month, which was a pretty big deal, just like they always used to go on on the show. And they shared many pictures from the big event. Amy said under this image, the pool. LPs love hanging out together at the pool, having a good time at the LPA National Conference in Austin, Texas. Amy mentioned that for her, this conference feels like home and that she loves just keeping in touch with people she met there as a little girl and that those friendships like are forever. They never fade. And Zach and Jackson played basketball and soccer in the sports league, of course. And uh, apparently Jackson says he was bawling out, which is cute. Tori seemed to love the experience as well, but she was not a fan of seeing the bats under the bridge in Austin, Texas, which is apparently a tourist attraction there. But basically she says, don't do the bats. So I guess we're going <laughs> to we're going to take her advice. She later said in a post, LPA 2023. This past week was the absolute best. I love watching my family play, laugh, and make connections. I am so blessed to be part of a community like this. Watching Jackson ball out at sports was so much fun. Watching Lila become a social butterfly and get her dance moves on was a joy. And watching Josiah meet new friends and almost take his first step was perfect. I thank God every day for my family and what he's opened my heart to. And when they came back from the conference, Amy started cooking again. She made this Mediterranean chicken and got trolled about her hair, unfortunately. And Tori got back and she said something felt off. She said when she came back, Today was tough, feeling overwhelmed with the world we live in and the world my kids are growing up in. We also just haven't gotten back in sync since Texas. It was heavy and frustrating. However, no matter how overwhelmed I get, I'm thankful for these three kids and that I get to be their mom. So I kind of wonder, like, what triggered this or was it just the standard mom overwhelming feeling that we all know so well? I mean, this is really normal, but I just wonder, like, did something happen? Like, anyways, I hope Tori... Tori probably got like a million messages saying how every mom feels that sometimes, but yeah, I hope she feels better by now. Amy and Chris also went fishing and did something with Matt and Karen to support the Little People Conference, and they were dressed in like cowboy outfits, so I guess we don't know exactly what that was, but seems like they are still all getting along and hanging out, and probably helped a lot by the Chris and Matt bromance friendship and the fact that they get along super well. Matt also shared an update on his house. Seems like the drywall is finally in and Matt is making sure that there are no steps whatsoever in that house. That's like his dream, a stairless house. Now let's move on to Audrey and Jeremy Roloff, who recently spent a lot of alone time without their kids actually. First they went to Grand Cayman Island for a retreat. I think it was for like the essential oils that Audrey sells. They went swimming with stingrays and seems like they enjoy a luxurious trip for sure. And as soon as they came back, they went straight to a country concert. 
Audrey said, We aren't big concert goers, but we flew home from our vacation one day early to make it back for the Chris Stapleton and George Strait concert, and it was fire. Of course, we love Chris, but the 90s George throwbacks had me belting. If you want to feel better about yourself, swipe to the end. Good thing Jer never heard my singing voice when we were dating, or he may have checked no. Thanks for putting up with my yelling. Honestly, that is a reference. Do you guys know that that song, Check Yes or No? Let me know in the comments. And then they got back and Audrey revealed that she plans on homeschooling her kids for a bit, actually. And Jeremy, well, Jeremy is still into like a million projects. It's kind of like his dad in that way. He is building a retaining wall with huge rocks. He said, rock wall project is well underway. This will be one of several retaining walls in the backyard. I've already learned quite a lot. Stacking boulders can be difficult, but I'm continually and thoroughly impressed with the dexterity and control of the equipment. It's going to take me longer than expected, haha, <laughs> but I'll get it. Maybe I'll post a video later describing some of the vision. And lastly, we finally got to see more of Jacob's son, Mateo, more than his hand, because that's all we saw up to now, basically. And I was surprised that he is completely blonde, it looks like, and so cute. Jacob had said, love of my life, my sweet Mateo, always asking to go for a ride and feed the animals and chickens. So gentle and adventurous, so smart, gets his hands dirty and says, whoa, when he falls. So proud to be his daddy. So that's awesome for Jacob, who I think is still living on the farm, like growing vegetables and, and helping out. As for filming, my best guess is that maybe Little People Big World and the roll-offs will be back in the fall sometime. They were spotted filming in the wintertime, seems like, from Instagram. I wonder if they did film at the Little P People conference. I'm not sure. Usually, sometimes the show likes to capture that. And usually things air like six months later. So I don't know, like my person. So far, no press release by TLC, no nothing. We're waiting on multiple seasons that have filmed uh, for like Plathville, for example, Sister Wives, Little People, Big World, all my favorites, you know, so I can't wait for the fall. And as usual, thank you so much for listening the whole way through. I really appreciate it. If you could please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed and I will be back soon with more updates. Bye guys!